All right, let's get into some hardcore. We are 42,001 level to go. So I, I think we're about 250,000 XP away from finishing. I think today our objective should be this task right here. So I think that 42,000 XP is, is a gimme. It's really not that difficult. All we need to do is go kill some stuff. So in the process, I think we just focus on any task that involves killing stuff at range in particular. Eliminate any PMC operators using RGDs. Not going to happen. Ah, oh, that's pointless. What was the reward? Squash and Vita Juice. This should be pretty straightforward. That's one interchange run. Survive two interchanges. Well, we can do that whilst we're in interchange. Eliminate PMC operators using F1 grenades. We need Euros. Jaeger and over six screwdrivers. I feel like six screwdrivers gonna be frustrating. Fuck off. Four Scavland extracts on reserve, and we get a tank battery. All right. So I'm doing one more at most after this. Eliminate scavs on in the thorax or stomach from a distance of 20 meters. I, can, I give up. Last one. Eliminate scouts with a headshot. There we go. That's what we wanted. 3BTG is actually what we need, isn't it? 3BTG. Done. See? I can only took all that effort. If we just grab this gun and put this on, right? Don't judge. Just hear me out. And for this gun, we mod it with this side. Cute little gun. Cute little gun. All right, so scav headshots, do two interchange runs while getting some juice. Should we get the interchange done out of the way first? All right, let's prepare this. I feel like we had a reserve task, sorry, a lighthouse task to kill stuff still. But well, we do need to kill these guys, the stray dogs. Oh, what was the last item needed for the Goshen key? Was it TP? Yeah, I need one more TP as well, chat. Oh, that's right. We were farming to Gila for ages. I remember now. This is what we could do at the same time. All right, let's go do this. We need a mag. Three mags of BP and a stack of PS. Four, five, six, seven. Let's go. By the way, what is your opinion on BSG removing Steam Audio? It's a bad decision. A really bad decision. It, Steam Audio is not the problem. It's their occlusion programming things that are done. That's the problem. What does Steam Audio mean? It's it's a setting they put on that makes it so... I, I can't explain it well. Veritas has a really good video. But it's pretty much... It, it shows kind of how... It's like how sound travels through a room. So it kind of gives like reverb and all that kind of stuff. It just makes it so you can identify the direction of sound a lot better. Pretty much. The easiest way I can explain it. Yeah, but is Quirky Audio really working? I, I would pick Steam Audio anytime over their old engine. Steam Audio is perfectly working in Hunt Showdown, for example, so I don't know why BSG is having such a hard time with Steam Audio. I think that the, the way I can explain it best, right? Tarkov or Battlestate Games, they put in this fucking audio system that was straight out of the box for Unity, right? And the way it works is no matter where you are, you hear that person through, through in that direction exactly like hunt showdown right and then people got mad because they were like i'm on the third floor of interchange or the top floor of interchange and i'm hearing people running hearing people run around the basement there's like nine foot of fucking concrete how the fuck can i hear someone through all those floors because it was all like this straight direction right so you'd be running along next to mantis and you'd hear someone underneath you and people lost their shit over that and before interchange they didn't have occlusions in but so what they did was like, all right, if the ground is like this big, like you're on a different plane of existence to to people from like the, the, the like in vertical planes, they made it that you couldn't hear people underneath you or above you. And the problem with that was, for example, staircases were horrible. Like you go, you can stand on a staircase and you can literally see the point in which audio turns back on when they're visible. So the fix broke it more. No, it was never broken. Audio in Tarkov was never broken originally. It was amazing. It was just like old school fucking Half-Life to me. The, the problem was people were like, it's not realistic. And BSG's way of trying to make it realistic fucked it. 
Like, if you're inside the second floor of a house in Hunt Showdown, right, and someone steps on a little fucking stick outside, you're most likely not going to hear it. Like, let's be honest. But Hunt Showdown, it doesn't matter. It's just a straight line. It's so it's it's it, that's just how it is. And it's not immersion breaking. It's not immersion breaking at all. In Hunt Showdown, if anything, you're fucking extremely immersed because you're like, is there any sound? Has anyone made a sound yet? Oh, where are the sounds? Like you are that zoned in, right? So if anything, I blame the community for always fucking arguing about realist, uh, realism because half the time people want realistic changes to the game, it fucks the game. Like, like, could you imagine if Nikita like just went full realistic? Every single like bit of armor would be fucking pointless. You get shit shot in the fucking, you'd get shot and just fall over. Rob CD, thanks to the raid. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck's going on? Chat. If you're following, you got the hail stand emote. Get the hail sta stand spammage. There's too much fucking CD in the chat. Let's take our chat back over. Where my stand's at. Rob, how was the stream? Hope you're really good. Here we go. Our chat now. Love us a Stan. Hell, Stan. Um, good, mate. That's awesome. Thanks for the massive raid. I'm guessing you're going to go dream hack. I mean, being fair, body armor isn't consistent even against FMJ IRL. So realism would make this game suck in a lot of ways. A hundred percent, bro. For IRL, yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Come say good day. I'll be there on I'll be there all day Saturday and most of Sunday. Video games aren't supposed to be fully realistic. No. If I wanted to play re like a realistic game, I'd just live life. Sword fight Phil, thanks to the prom. If you get shot, you should immediately know where you are getting shot from. Not true. No fucking way. If you get shot, right, the first thing you should do is just fall over and scream in agony. Like you've just been fucking Spartan kicked by Leonidas himself. Sounded actually pretty close. Buttons! What is your profession? Blacksmith, sir. The best thing, the best thing they could have done in that situation would have been to lie. Have a bit of fun with it. Be like, what is your profession? Only fans, sir. <laughs> there is. I think there's someone down in this house. Support advisor, sir. 
What do you think about being able to go prone on back? For what purpose? Role playing a turtle? <laughs> to sleep? Is he dead? You're dead, man! Kind of looks dead. Hit him. Not dead. Stiffy's TV takes a 10 months. Ranger Daniel thinks it's a bitch. People don't realize how well suppressors work at confusing your enemy uh, to your location. <clears throat> I've only ever used a suppressor once. It was with a, uh, I believe it was an SV-98. And I shit you not, it was fucking loud. It was so fucking loud. Like, I thought it was, like, going to be a little bit more like the movies, like, a decent amount of suppression. Nope, it just looked, it was just fucking loud. Just trying to hide the bang and crack, sorry, the bang in the crack bang. Trying to hide the crack. Um. It lit, like, okay, so. It probably reduced the, the decibels quite a large amount. I'm just making the point of it was still fucking really loud. From a distance though, it works right. I, I would say, I don't know. It might, you might be able to hear it from half the distance instead. Maybe two thirds of the distance instead. I should log when you said that. Yeah, but often the distance, it makes a difference. The biggest benefit in is flash depression at night. Yeah, I, I haven't. I, I don't know. I, I, I'll take your word for it. I believe you. And I, and I know that's like a large amount of the purpose is to... Is to uh, just help re like reduce noise pollution and... What did you think of Destiny Pest? It's, dude, it's a lot of fun. I actually... I was talking about it before, how, um... Do you reckon that was the rogue? I feel like I'm gonna die here. Let's keep moving. What if that was... Oh my god, what if that was fucking one of the goons? Excuse me, are you a goon? We'll work it out later. How does one finish Hardcore Tarkov? Uh, I've got to get... Max traders, and I'm at level 40. R -R. R -R. Uh, the sub border takes eight months. Eggy, thanks for six months. Untapped. Gotta make sure I get those headshots. Over 80 meters. Right, that one's dead. Oh, we forgot one. Go back.
Fred's can of scans, yeah. Come on. One tapped. I'm good at this game. That was a raider or a player in the window. He was like on the second, like the window on the second floor. It wasn't the top of the roof. It's a fucking raider. He was literally shooting me through the window on the second floor. You could see him strafing right at the end. It wasn't a player chat. <sighs> Triple tap me in the chest. What do you reckon? Interchange raid. We go this rig. I want to do no backpack so I can take no backpack extract. I'm thinking of the UMP at the moment. To make it very clear, I think that death was bullshit and that the uh, bot should have a, have a nasty cough or something. I don't know. Money, money, money. It's so funny in a rich man's world. All right, we are after. Operation grab a squash and a vita juice. Lucky Chan 82, thanks for the tier one. Dude, you've been sub before. I am confident. I've spoken to you. Did you get banned or something? Like, not from me, but like banned in general or something? Like, nah, I've said your name before. So you're not speaking with the unsubs? Peasants. All of them. Say my name, Daddy. Smell. Smelf it, whoever smelf it dealt it. Spanish John. If they never speak to me, Master, please. Must mad. Dono World? Who was Dono World? Sorry for being a pleb, but thanks for the content. No. I don't think you're a pleb. Uh, honestly, subscriber or not, you're a part of the community. That's how I see it. All you got to do is hang out here. Say good day from time to time. You don't even have to hang out here often. Every now and then, you know. I'd probably say, like, you can hang out at least once a year. You're part of the community, you know. be coming up to five years of hanging out. Keep the plebs thinking they matter, right? Hey, mate, I'm farming more for ad revenue just like the subs too, so. One, one, one. one tapped. You see that one tap right there, chat? Doing your dad's jokes. I have a dad. Someone's gonna clip that and take it to the toast. One on the bitch. There's still a salute. Proud salute right here, mate. No problem with that. The grass is greener here. All serrated, thanks for six months. Where is here? Uh, Lakesa, thanks for the 26 months. Charlie Major, thanks for gifting a sub to Super Super. Gummy, thanks for gifting a sub to Hype Snipe. Draconra, thanks for the three months. Or MLS, thanks for the two months. Is that the juice we need? We need the Vita juice, the vitamin juice, and the squash. Where's all the juice? 
I'll suck toes for a sub right now. Careful what you wish for, bro. Not even a fucking squash here. There's one. Just had to prove me wrong, didn't you? Bit of pool. Bit of juice. We got him. We got him, chat. Let's go. Just one of each, wasn't it? Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Real deal, Lucille. What's one thing you love the most about your IRL dad? Um, he's a very loving man. He loves his family very, very much, and I think that's a very, very uh, beautiful thing about my dad. We all have our flaws. We all do things from time to time that, you know, they're not always great, but my dad, I swear to God, loves his family. Did the guy get a gifted sub? You guys are going to tee up that time for the, the toe sucking? I suppose he didn't say which toe specifically he would suck. <sighs> Any toe sucking is a good toe sucking. So... True story. In the first podcast we filmed, we spoke about foot fetishes and toe sucking. Yeah, in the first episode of the podcast, we talk about toe sucking, and then Michael fucked the recording and the audio, so we lost the we lost that part of the fucking thing. We'll have to discuss it again at a later date. But let's just say. Michael sucked a toe in his day. Classic Michael. Dude, it really is classic Michael. We need we need 33 more headshot. Sorry, 33 more kills from 80 meters chat. We've got to, we have to get that done today. Right, today. No is no buts, no maybes. We are getting it done today. Again. Was there an empty mag was there? I'm going back. I'm going back. Can you do another review review video on checking your and chat? and their responses. How about I get Michael to do that video? How about I get Michael to decide the fate of people's... You know all those videos that people make, like my girlfriend, like going through my girlfriend's unbanned requests. I think like Ludwig did it for QT Cinderella and stuff. I could do all those kind of videos with Michael. I just get Michael to be on cam and he can just go through all the videos. to go through all the unbanned requests. Title it getting my girlfriend to it's not a lie. What's not a lie? I should go I should go this way. <laughs> Michael and Pest, a better love story than Twilight. Amen. Do you see boys like low with us? Boy! Is there a barter trade that uses that? I don't think there is. When is Michael going to play Tarkov on stream? Probably soon. So the idea we've got going at the moment is Michael's going to play Tarkov and I'm going to literally be breathing over his shoulder telling him how he's doing everything wrong. Do you only play Tarkov when you stream? Pretty much. Just wondering how that works when it's part of your job. I only play Tarkov when I'm on stream unless it's the raid series or I'm filming a YouTube video that requires it.
Any recommends on how to make a lot of rubles? Scav running. Because even if you die, you don't lose anything. It's all profit. Um, do exclamation mark money. There's a heap of uh, YouTube videos showing a heap of loot spots. A little bit dated the videos, but the loot spots are still the same. I still check the same spot. There's probably just more spots to check. Hidden stashes are a, a, an absolute gem. If you don't know where the hidden stashes are on maps that you frequent, you should learn it. Like if, if you play a lot of customs, interchange, woods or shoreline, you should um, learn all the hidden stash locations. The amount of times they've gotten me out of trouble or I found an armor that was an upgrade or a helmet that was an upgrade. Quest items that I needed just because I was running past the hidden stash and I just picked it up. Picked it out on the way through. They literally have the RNG of any item in the game minus like 10 items. They don't have keys actually. Besides keys and like 10 items, they literally got everything else in the game. Wheat cars here. Oh, isn't that the isn't that what we needed? The last one? No, we need like we need a need TP. We needed the ear slants for something too though. Are stealth builds possible in this game? No. The only way you become stealthier is if you level up your covert movement skill. Toast as close as you get to a stealth taco player. Break my arm? No. We just gotta get the survive and then we're gonna go back on the hunt for long range long range kills. Need two more headshots. And that gets part of the samples done too. And then we're gonna go back on to killing 33 33 more people from 80 meters away. I'm gonna try and put lighthouse on farm. Chat, I really need to go do a code brown. All right, you guys protect if I die, it's on you guys. Well, you had one job chat, one job. You're lucky, you did it. Claps in the chat. Claps in the chat, you did your job. I don't know why I'm applauding you guys for doing your job, but you did it. What's your favorite genre of music to game to? Techno or dance or trance. When I when I play stuff like um like Eve Online and that, or WoW, and I'm just fucking jamming out, I would like this is before you could use YouTube, but I would be like uh, WoW grinding music. I would usually just. Like he's one of actually fucking used. I would just go to something like this. Oh, I need two more of them. Wait, you played Eve? Yeah. Yeah. Never again. I love Eve. I think it's actually an amazing game. Never again. All right, hand that quest in now. What? 
My issues with M4s, I don't feel like they ever do enough damage. Emotional damage. Alright, I'm just gonna go like this. Why not use M4s? They just don't do enough damage against rogues. We're gonna go on the rogue hunt. We are in. This is a good spawn for killing rogues. So can't watch for long. Okay. We hit six months. Best of raids to you today. Obliterate. Bam, six to six months, bro. Dang school kids, don't do drugs. Was it do drugs? Don't stay to school. I can't remember. Pest, you're a true legend. You're a legend too. Do man 13. Thanks to tier three for 29 months. Watch them goddamn mines. Uh, Dolphy TV, don't have a problem yours, bro. Appreciate you hanging out, saying good day. No fucking way, they're already dead. He's dead there. You can see him dead. Am I about to get beamed in the head? Yeah. Fuck off. I just want to get blacked out then. Wait, that guy's dead too. Nice to love. Thank you for that. No worries, dude. Scott and 89 takes the 40 months. I've got a video on me farming these. How to do it quickly. Very sometimes hard on second floor of this building. Oh, thanks. It wasn't obvious in the previous raid. Oh, I got emotional damage.
Uh, what, what is the name of this scope? Not the voodoo one. It's the Burris one. Burris Fullfield. Fullfield. There's definitely another one out on that one. I'm... Should be one over here somewhere. I've got to be careful because there might be a guy on the hill behind me that was going to shoot me in the back of the head. Hey, Red Ops, there you go, man. Hey, man. You know, we finished hardcore, which means we can do some normal raids here, though. Wait, that door doesn't start open. Hello? Hello? There's, I think there's rogues in this building. Excuse me, sir. Hello? This is where I got clapped from fucking across the map. Um, Pazzo Garth, thanks for eight months, dude. Bomb sub, ahoy pest, keep up the great work, thanks, man. Uh, we're doing hardcore until Max Traders. We have no choice. We need to know what's happening here. This door does not start open, does it? Good, I'm down for that. How was the hardcore run starting earlier? So much better. And having access to NA. I think if I didn't have access to NA, I would have quit Tarkov this while. No word of a lie. Because of cheaters, guys, I, I'm not even memeing here. It was unplayable for like a week. Like, I know people say that's bad, but. That week was that, that it was like, it was like from day three of the wipe onwards. Day four of the wipe onwards. They did that. Yeah, they upped their ping limit. Oh god, I should check. I should check. These four there. Pretty much always one on. The third one on this roof. Other side of this. I need to check these ammo. BT's not actually that bad. I want to see you play with Toast more. Uh, I rotate my servers every stream. Sometimes I'm playing on NA, sometimes I'm not. And sometimes I'm playing on OCE in Singapore, Japan. 
Hong Kong. I, I, I rotate it all the time, just so then that way, to be honest, it just, so people can't stream snipe me. Ref K thinks it's tier three for 22 months. When I film the race series, I just do, depending on the time of the day, whatever's going to be the most populated servers. Otherwise, I get messages saying, oh, this person's going to be playing on the quietest servers in the world. When literally, like, sometimes you just have a raid that's quiet. Car there. No car is there. Wait, I didn't loot. I didn't loot that car, did I? Lance, thanks to the uh, 20 months, dude. Legend. We get some salutes in the chat for Raph Cake with that tier 3 for 22 months. Very generous of you, bro. If you don't have my emails, go to 100 channel point channel lock any of my emails you get a month. There's a loot, a salute spamage. Call me Rafiki, thanks to tier 3 for 31 months. You can do double salutes for Rafiki. We're proud salutes. <laughs> You can't take that away from us. Wiseman08, thanks for nine months. And first, thanks to all the content. All right, dude. Jeepsy with a T3 sum for 16 months. That's three T3 sums in a row. Actually, no, it's not. It's, okay, okay. It's four tier three subs out of the last six. Doctor with the 16 months tier three. Slutes, rise up. I can hear you. Hail Stan. Hail Stan. Remember when someone says Hail Stan? The only appropriate way to respond back. Hail Stan. Should we, um, I should try and get like a thousand Hail Stan t shirts printed for like TwitchCon. And I just give them out for free. And then everyone walks around saying, with t wearing t shirts saying Hail Stan, but no one understands why. Oh. I would do that, but my wife would kill me. I would honestly pay for a hail stand t-shirt. Um, you want to go to your Twitch page and that? We got this one done, but we still need to do this one. 30 more kills. And do we only get three kills over 80 meters that raid? No way. Three. 
Maybe shoreline would be better. I think this map's more consistent. Are you nocturnal? I mean, do I stay up all night? I do. Der Burger, Der Burger, thanks for 22 months. Go to the lighthouse expansion, rogues can spawn there too. Um, I need to kill rogues near the helicopter. Watching from the space boat for the first time, in runs like a dream. Love um, some dumb 84, thanks for the four months and congrats on winning, a, uh, winning one of the computers. Uh, yeah, because that first few were dead, even though I fucking sprinted. Bit lame, actually. Such good XP farming those rogues, though. I need to clean up this stash. Might just sell that one, actually. All right, we just need an AHF1M. The AHF is common on Emicon in woods with the Obidos. We could do a woods run just to mix it up. How many more proper ones do I need? I need four more. Maybe I'll try and get these four and then we'll go woods. How about that? I kind of like the idea because this is 18,000 XP. Almost two years with the best dad there is. What was your honest opinion of Destiny 2 yesterday? Dude, honestly, it was a lot of fun. It was a little bit overwhelming at the start, but I, I, I think I understand it now. And I think, um, I think I'm going to, like today I woke up and I was like, I'm pretty keen to play Destiny 2 today. So, and like, for example, uh, I went well over my sponsor time yesterday. Like I was enjoying it. Exclamation mark Destiny or exclamation mark Destiny 2 if you are interested in checking it out. It's free to play Destiny 2. All the DLCs are available for free this week. And obviously that I've, I've been sponsored to play it, but I actually think it's a pretty good game. And everyone's really friendly. That, that was actually really cool too. Obviously they were joining me because I'm a streamer and they probably know me, but like, I actually feel like the, the community most likely is a quite friendly community. Hi, Pestoy. How do you stay motivated to keep my tank off? You know your progression gets reset every few months. This has been a really holding me back. Think of every playthrough as its own story. Like the different things that happen along the way, you know, like. For me, I've generally found Tarkov to be a lot less enjoyable once I have got all the progression done. Like once I get the capper, I usually get pretty bored of the game. Ooh, Mizera, thanks for three months. Which is why on my main account, I haven't really pushed past the hardcore, so for hardcore, for the Kappa. Like, I'll get, I'll get, uh, max traders on this account, then I'll go back to the main account. And then once I go back to the main account, I'm still not going to be like, all right, today I'm going to be fucking speed running these quests. I'm just going to be like, yeah, sweet. We'll just keep playing it. And if we get some quest progression, sweet. If not, sweet. Like, I'm not going to sit down at the pier on shoreline for like a week straight to try and get the the kills. I'll do it for like a day. And then I'll be like, chat! Load in! <laughs> I actually really like the idea of um, me and Bear Key telling you guys what server we're in. You guys queue snipers. And then we say, all right, no going down to the pier before X period of time. And then we go down to the pier and then you guys try and attack us. That would be fun with co-op offline. What's 
shoreline pop 16. So it'd be like 14v2. What am I? I'm using BP. If I were to be standing there, you would be, oh, you would, oh, I'd be dead. I don't know how you get these empty lighthouse rains. Did you not hear the gun firing? There's other people in here. Literally the fucking... I'm playing on your service chat. You guys join the same service as me. I stopped playing on the streamer service ages ago. Hello, excuse me, sir. What is this? There's player there, 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 and over there. It's full fucking up there. Do you reckon these are the uh the goons, hey? If I threw a grenade, would that make the sense? Would that make the sense? It was the goons. Fuck, he was literally right on the edge there. Man, he fucking shot fast. That sucks. The one tap me in the chest with a fucking M1A. Not M1A, sorry. Uh, what did that mean? DVL, depressed. I actually thought it was up at the house. I threw the grenade. That, that audio clip cue was not the guy right next to me. All right. Again. I need the cash for the car. Is the goal for Kappa this one? Is it, that's a yes or no question, is it? I will go for Kappa on the main account eventually. So any plans when the hardcore season is Yeah, over? I'll switch over to the main account and I'll be leveling up the main account and getting the Kappa done on the main. I will start a new series a little bit later on, but I don't know if I'll be doing it on stream or off stream. And you have a week of questing with your best year bear key, right? After hardcore's done. Yeah, I still do that. I love the raid series because it's off stream, to be honest. Yeah, the, the raid series is an interesting one this wipe. Normally it does a lot better, but Hardcore's like Hardcore is doing a lot better than uh raid. Like performance wise. And the raid's a lot more time consuming. Is there is there any actual um question? Destructive feedback only? No, don't need just abuse. Is there any reason why um You guys don't watch the raid over the hardcore this one? Not much new content. I enjoy the race here as I've been watching it. I watch raid only. Michael feels more staky. YouTube likes to shove the hardcore series down my throat. That's because, okay, my theory is the first episodes of the hardcore did better because I put it out like first week of the wipe. Pretty same, but I like the struggle. I feel like I can only keep up with one. Raid won't be new until Tarkov does something new. I can't. I can't agree with that. That's why ha uh, Raid will only go to the max traders as well. There's no point farming up the Kappa for the sake of farming the Kappa. I am one of the viewers of the raid. I watch it every day on my lunch break. But can't answer why not. But I can say I am trying to get back into Tarkov myself. So putting Raid first. Yep. 
Hogwarts needs more in line with the spirit of EFT. Wasn't a goon as well, was it? it? Was a player, right? Geo HD, thanks for prom. Hello? Okay. Excuse me? Hello? Hello? So... He moved really weird. Excuse me, sir. Hello? I also have the question of how did he get there so quick? Is anyone there? The other, the other goons would be here if, if it was a goon. I'm going to go with that. That was a double shot. Should I go back? Player. He looted that. I don't know if you're a goon or a player. If you're a player, I won't, I'll leave you alone. Much, man. This came from Sniper Rock. I thought they were more lower. Contact, please. Why 
be a while. Seems so weird. Oscar? Just normal scavs. What do you rate the Elkan? It's alright. Okay, I'll pop that thing over. I think it's just a normal scav. Place next to the four. It's the four months, man. A med bag in here? I can't remember now. Maybe on the bottom floor? <laughs> this is my least played map. We're gonna die, to be honest. Like how you guys like, it should be a med bank upstairs. They're not. It's not a CMS on the table. with no beer. 
got in there, it'd be awkward. I probably wouldn't be able to get out. One thing I'd probably prefer over anything right now would be a um, Aquamari or something like that. Forget to give you the Bezos money, Fran. Well, I appreciate it when you do. Thanks so much. Uh, I'll read your name properly. I'm sorry. Want something to loot? The Baka. Seven. Thanks for five months, mate. Bit bullshit if you ask me. Not even just normal loot. We go, this will shut us up for a little bit. Should I go up there, you reckon? No. I could have scattered over here, actually. I just have to keep my head and my chest healed, nothing else. That way I can be dehydrated and still heal. <laughs> I 
There'll be food and drink up here, Pest, at least for sure. There's always food and drink here. Once again, chat lying to me. Under the hanging pig. One tap. The good news is, no player killed me. Got one scab of 80 meters. I just sucked. The good news is it's over and we don't have to hear the moaning and groaning.